Have all. you been holding down a job while you've been doing all this? Um, not for the last five years, no, that's my full-time job. Have you lived? Well, by, by selling those and no, also... No. You haven't made any money yeah, selling I know, You made 7,000 quid. I'm living very low-key. And also, I was um, very fortunate in getting um, government, government grants. More taxpayers' money. H how much did the government give you? Uh, 148,000 altogether. If anybody else comes in front of me and says they've had money off the government, it's taxpayers' money, for some ridiculous business venture, I'm going offshore. I'm sick and tired of seeing the money being wasted, the taxpayers' money, and grants for businesses that are just worthless. A cry of frustration from Duncan Bannatyne and an uncomfortable moment for the entrepreneur. Will Deborah Meaden offer him some respite? Ralph, hi, I'm Deborah. I don't share Duncan's rant on grants. I think grant system is a very good system to have to get product off the ground. Mm -hmm. What worries me is you won't care if I hand my £120,000 over because it's not your money. And when it is your money, I tell you, Ralph, it feels a lot, lot different in driving costs down because I think if you didn't get £150,000 from the grant system, we'd be sitting here with that costing a lot less money to produce. In the opposite, I, I would actually like to argue that I've been very economical with the money I was given to get to the point where I am. Well, you haven't. And yeah. Can I tell you, Ralph, you haven't, because Theo and I know nothing at all about this tooling, but gut feeling, I'm thinking, God, if somebody gave me, a, somebody quoted to me £70,000, you know, ridiculous. Okay. So I'm afraid, Ralph, I'm out. OK, thank you. It's a first setback for Ralph as Deborah Meaden walks away from the deal. And James Kahn is ready to declare his position. For a guy who's a bright, intelligent person, to come in here with four cones with lights on there and expect me to value your business at £600,000, mm -hmm. you must think we're mad. You must do. Well, the valuation is based on investment I've received before from private investors, uh, altogether £55,000. Mm -hmm. So after £200,000, you sold seven grand. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous, Ralph. I'm out. Ralph, you talked about primary schools. Mm -hmm. When my grandfather was a boy, mm -hmm. it might have been intriguing to see lights flashing in different ways. Mm -hmm. But I don't really think that when children now look at technology, mm -hmm. that's what they're thinking about. I think it's advanced way beyond that. Only a complete idiot would invest in this, so I'm out. <laughs>